Hey there guys, Gal with account 23 back with another video. And this is going to be a bit of a kind of a random unboxing. Um, I thought, because I've bought kind of a few, uh, well, three titles that are kind of part of the same collection. So I thought I'd do an unboxing video because I just kind of felt like making a kind of a, a video that's not part of my, uh, you know, that's not a, um, a, a, uh, Blu-ray overview, overview video because I've uploaded like one of those a day and that's sometimes kind of the only video I upload and uh, people don't really want to watch don't really want to watch it so anyway I suppose if they don't watch it they don't watch it simple as that uh, a few uh, well one big one one small one for Amazon Prime and like I said it's part of the uh, same collection so I'll go, uh, open this Open the first one, or the small one first, even I should say. And the first one we have is, get it out, it is a Ponyo. Now you'll see a theme going through these. Uh, this being the uh, Blu ray and DVD combo. I do I already, I already own this on DVD, but I really wanted it on a Blu ray. Uh, basically, I was, I was on Amazon and I kind of felt, I just had this urge to buy one or two uh, Ghibli titles. And I just kind of picked like the cheapest ones. I think I got all of them for under twelve quid, I believe. Or I think one of them might be might have been over twelve. I'll uh, open these. Big fan of Studio uh, Ghibli. Ghibli. It depends how, how you kind of pronounce it, but I've heard something that um, I think if you pronounce it wrong, you're saying the word whore or something. I think that was Ghibli anyway, which is kind of strange. But. Uh, the uh, optimum, well, when it when it actually was optimum releasing, it isn't anymore. It's now Studio Canal. There uh, we have the uh, Blu-ray, yeah, the Blu-ray there, and then DVD there. Nice artwork, same as on the uh, front, and it's the same on the Blu-ray and DVD. Nice uh, slip cover though. And the I know these are available in the the US versions, but I kind of I kind of prefer these ones to be honest. I don't know, it's just kind of, it's just, it just looks a bit nicer in my opinion, but, but look, anyway, and uh, this one here, and, oh, I love these things, uh, yeah, next up we have uh, Howl's Moving Castle, oh by the way that was number uh, 17 in the series, and then we have uh, Howl's Moving Castle again, uh, <coughs> excuse me, uh, Blu-ray and DVD combo, uh, my mum's a big fan of this film as well. Uh, I remember seeing this at the uh, cinema, really, really enjoying it. The first um, Ghibli film I saw at the cinema was *A Spirited Away*, and uh, again, nice slip cover. I just love the fact that they're, they're kind of uniform, so they look so they look good on the shelf. And then open this one as well. Oh man, my throat! <coughs> Excuse me. Um, luckily, we haven't got the uh, thunderstorms that are going round, but we might possibly get that tonight. But I, I honestly welcome it, to be honest. It's, the weather's too hot, but anyway. Me babbling, about, babbling on about the weather, and the disc is loose, but it's, that's alright. I know this one's set up a bit differently, it's the face-to-face uh, -face, uh, Blu-ray case, that rhymed. Uh, different artwork on the Blu-ray, the Blu-ray and the DVD. Uh, very nice indeed. And then again, really nice slip cover. And uh, this one's number seven. Now these aren't going; these numbered ones aren't in order of kind of release. I think. Well, another not, but I don't exactly sure what order they are. Oops. I'm still waiting for a spirit, Spirited Away on a Blu-ray. I don't know when that's coming. Hopefully soon. And the next one we have, a, or the third and last one, we have a Whisper of the Heart. Um, I don't think I've watched this one. Um, it's not one of the more well-known ones. Again, let's look at this is number five. And get it open. I don't know why they haven't brought Spirited Away on Blu-ray yet. It's definitely my, well, my scent, well, it's probably my joint favourite between Castle in the Sky and Spirited Away. I uh, mainly Spirited Away because it was kind of the first one I ever saw. Which 
remember once my uh, my kind of grandmother um, kind of mentioned that they were showing this animated film at the local cinema, and I had no idea what it what it was about or what kind of an animation it was. But we went to see it, and I was actually I was absolutely captivated by the whole thing. I absolutely loved it. I get this sucker open, yeah. But yeah, it's a really good memory for me seeing Spirit Away for the first time. And again, we have uh, different artwork on the Blu-ray and DVD. We have the uh, Blu-ray there, I think. No, nope, sorry. DVD there even, and the Blu-ray there. Did you check something? Oh yeah, it must have been there. Uh, these, these two must have come out uh, when it still was Optum releasing. No, sorry. This one must have been when it wasn't. Opt no, when this one must have came out when it was Optimum releasing, and then these two came out when it uh, became Studio Canal. Quite interesting. And uh, yeah, again, nice slip cover, really nice artwork on these. And uh, that's it. Try and get these in number order. There we are, 5, 7 and 17. I also have Cast in the Sky, I think that's it actually, because I really want to kind of kind of build up my uh, Ghibli, Cle or Ghibli Ghibli collection, but um, they're always so expensive, I mean, I mean H&V were bad at the, work, at the, at the best of times, but 18 quid for Kiki's Delivery Service on Blu-ray DVD combo, it's really not worth that, well, not, I say it is worth that much, but I'm not paying 18 quid for one Blu-ray DVD. Blu-ray and DVD, it's ridiculous. But anyway, there we have uh, Wisp, uh, I can't remember what order it is. Uh, Whisper of the Heart, Howl's Moving Castle, and Ponyo. Uh, so I haven't seen Whisper of the Heart, really like Howl's Moving Castle, and it's been a while since I haven't actually seen Ponyo since I saw it at the cinema, but I think I've quite enjoyed it. It's more of a kind of a family friendly one, that. But that's about it. Some Studio Ghibli titles. So yeah, so that's about it. I uh, don't think there's anything else to say. So please rate, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.